What are two to three protocols, habits, mindsets, let's call them shortcuts, because everybody likes shortcuts, for longevity and a long health span that you would share? Oh, I think the first one is really about your mental attitude. I've heard this so much from so many people that have lived longer. It's what your attitude is to life. So gratefulness is one, shifting perspective. We all live in a world where it's our choice to, to basically see it as we want. So if we could shift that into that level, that cascading level of HPA access, the NEI system and everything changes. And we basically change our biochemistry by our thoughts. So I think just that ability to get into an attitude of gratitude, to be able to truly have positive thoughts and see the world in a positive prism, incredibly impactful to our longevity. Don't worry, be happy. Like just play that song over and over and like do that. And you truly will, I think, extend your life and see a, a happier life no matter who you are. I think the other end of that, of like a, a something that I see too many people, it's like, get out of the rat race. Like, do it on your own. Don't listen to societal norms. You know, truly be an independent maverick. The healthiest people I've found around are ones that don't abide this idea. They need the nine to five to do and they got to work hard and never like, you know, balance and sacrifice their health to get ahead. You don't have to do that. I do think hard work is a very important part of it. And I think that's healthy. But like anything, too many stressors is a bad thing. I love the idea of cryotherapy and saunas and shock there and all these things that are stressors that kind of make us stronger. But too much of that is also too much stress, right? Mm. We're already living in a place where we give ourselves chronic stress. We are the creators of that. So I do think that going against norms and being really, really open-minded and finding what works for you and truly being in tune with yourself, get into nature, really focus on building your intuition and learn what is the best for me and just go with it. Don't care what anyone else says, what your family even says, if you, they think you're crazy, what's the society said, like, just do it. Be very, very authentic and true. And I think that's the healthiest version of you. All right. So we've got mental attitude, grateful and positive, and then be, be that maverick, especially when it comes to your health. Yeah. <laughs>